What's going on guys? Today I am back with another Destiny 2 video and today I bring you guys the best token farming method within the entire game. Hands down, there's nothing better so far. Uh, but before we get into the video and before I show you guys this epic farming method, if you want to win some seriously badass loot, simply drop a like on the video and leave a comment down below. I've got gift cards, I've got emblem codes, I've got absolutely all sorts. To win some, like I said, drop a like on the video and leave a comment down below. Winners are picked from my Discord server. Now, this actual method is brought to you guys by a guy called Ero. His Twitter can be found linked within the video description. Go show him some love because he is the original founder of this actual farming method. Now, it's located on the Moon Titan, which I will show you guys exactly where you need to spawn into. So, go here. We jump on this one right here, and we want to go down to the rig landing zone. So you want to uh, fly down to this here, and you'll spawn in this spot where I am. Simple as that. And you want to head in that direction. But before we do that, and I'll show you guys this location, um, a few content creators, a few fellow content creators, have posted the same spot, claiming you can earn a thousand tokens or more per hour, which to me sounded too good to be true. So I tested this theory. I tested this theory on my first Hunter, which I was grinding new monarchy tokens with. I started out with 69 tokens. I ended up with 622. This was an hour exactly. Well, probably about an hour, 10 seconds, but that don't matter. I ended up gaining 553 tokens within that hour, which is still incredible. Not quite a thousand, but it is incredible. Setup I was using um, was these right here, the Stump EE5s. I did have 10 mobility as well. I don't know why it's gone down to 9. I've probably changed something, but that don't matter. I had 10 mobility and a Stump EE5s. Weapon of choice, I would suggest you using a scout rifle with this perk on it. Explosive payload, because it just makes quick work. It uh, creates we're going to destroy, which gives us the tokens. It two shots them. It's as simple as that. Now, there are many scouts in the game which have this on, uh, but a name of Midnight is the one I used. So it's just absolutely incredible. But so yeah, not quite a thousand tokens per hour, but still quite, quite good. 500 plus is incredible. Um, also as well, guys, now this is seriously important, but I'll get to the last sector where we're going to do this first and then explain. So you want to jump down here and you want to head across the last, well, that last sector right there. So jump across here and run through this door. Now it's down there. But actually, before we go any further, and this is seriously important, Bungie helped tweet out earlier saying that if you've got 230 faction packages with your with your faction of choice, whether that be New Monarchy, Future Walker, or Dead Orbit, any package after that 30th package will only give you shaders. So there's no point going into this grind without knowing the exact number of packages you have opened with your faction. Because you come and do this for 400 tokens, uh, you go to your, uh, your faction, you've already opened up 25 uh, packages. You're going to have wasted so many tokens and so much of your time doing this farm for just shaders. So what you want to do is you want to head to a website called Destiny Tracker. I will link it within the video description. Simply enter your gamer tag into this website. It will show you guys exactly how many ranks you've got with each faction. So yeah, it's probably best you doing another character with another faction if your first main character is already at like 25 packages or whatever because there's no point farming this unless you want to reach 30 packages that's fine farm this for about 10 minutes you should do that it's easy it's fast it's simple it's efficient but yeah definitely check out destiny tracker and definitely see how many packages you've already opened because i don't understand why bungie are punishing us for farming a game about farming we doing what we enjoy doing and they punish us it's just ridiculous so yeah now this is the rig area this is very important we actually well, well i'll come i'll explain what you gotta do and i'll explain this part in a quick second so you want to follow the route i am taking and you want to fly down this ramp and you want to jump over here and now we're in cargo bay 3 this is where the this is where the magic happens in this room there are six crates now i'm calling them crates because they're crates on edz they're not quite crates here but still we call them crates okay so what they are they are located you can see one there back of the map you can see one there behind that enemy if you the aim assist would let me shoot it i hate the aim assist in the game one there there we go there's also one that can spawn right here i'll try not to um Get taken out, one there. Normally can one can spawn right there as well. And normally one can spawn right there as well. And there's normally one over there, which is there right now. So once you've taken out six, you simply want to head to the middle of the room and let these kill you, let these take you out. Hopefully they will spawn me in the incorrect spot so I can show you guys what you can do. No, nope, it spawned me basically where you want to be spawned, which is right here. So you simply just follow the process we just did. 
you went to that room, follow the route I am taking, so so easy, so so fast, so so efficient in getting them tokens, it seriously is, so you simply just want to do this, we try it again, and hopefully it, it basically, um, spawns me in the incorrect, it only does it like 5% of the time, which is fine, is there another one there, yes there is, is there one back here, yes there is, reload, 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 okay, one there, and remember guys, these actually explode, so yeah, you don't want to stand next to them. There we go. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. Hopefully now it spawns me in the incorrect place, so I can show you guys where you got to run to. No, it keeps doing it. It keeps doing it. Oh, I ain't gonna do it. It isn't gonna do it. Uh, but yeah, it doesn't really matter anyway because you guys will know where. It normally spawns you about here. Normally about here, on these steps. If it does, you want to run back to where we just was, the rig area, and then simply come back on yourself. That's what it would do. Then when you're here, just take out as many as you can. Don't try not to shoot the ads if they don't get in your way, that is. But normally they do get in your way because they're, you know, pain in the butts. Shoot that one. Get rid of that one. Get rid of that one. One there. There's no, normally one can spawn there as well. One over here. Yes, there is. One there. Yes, there is. There's one there as well, which I'll take out. There we go. And just simply just run to the middle of the room and let them take you out. But it's so, so fast and it's so, so efficient, people. It's just incredible. It's just so, so good. It seriously is. Now, please spawn me in the wrong spot so I can show people. You just ain't going to do it. Yes, it did. Yes, it did. Okay, so once you spawn here or anywhere near here, you simply want to run back. If you don't spawn in the rig area, which I'll show you guys, you want to run back. You want to run back to it. Take the route I am taking and you'll come to this. If you don't spawn here, then you need to run back to this area. Where it says rig in the bottom left corner. That's all you got to remember. That's all you've got to remember and simply run back, run down this ramp, and simply rinse and repeat this process. It's so, so good, people. It's seriously a massive shout out again to e -Raw for finding this and sharing this because it's just you know, unbelievable. Unbelievable. Get out of my way, Olga. He hits, he hits like a train. No, still not one there. I haven't been spawned there in this run. It was spawned there all the time for me earlier. One there, nope. But there is one there. And even if you got a rocket launcher on you, you could just destroy yourself with it. You don't have to wait for the enemies, but yeah. And that's that, that's it, guys. That is the farm. And you can see how much you can earn. I'm, am I on future war part on this character? Yeah, yeah, I'm 692. Like I said, only 600 will count towards actual loot besides shaders. So yeah, I'm going to jump on my Titan now and farm this till I get 600 with him, with Dead Orbit. So yes, guys, but yeah. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks as always for stopping by. If you're new around here and enjoy daily Destiny videos, be sure to subscribe. If you never want to miss a video I upload, hit that bell button next to that subscribe button to receive email notifications of when I do upload. But thanks as always for stopping by people and I will catch you on that next one. Always in the